a small town of Ladava, and uh, we lived there a family of about seven. And we made a living through more or less. We had a cow, we had a, a horse, and whatever you grew, you saved in the, in the summer, you put away for the winter. to call them pogroms, P-O-G-R-O-M, community by surrounding an assault on the Jewish community by surrounding uh, peasants. And uh, I remember we were hiding in cellars uh, for two or three days down there. And when I came up, I saw wagon loads of dead Jews who were being picked up from the streets just hauled away. So that's the way we started uh, on our trip to uh, Antwerp. We went through several countries. My mother and I got to Antwerp. It took us about three or four months to make the journey.
very, very crowded. You know, they used to have these bunks one on top of the other, and uh, that was very the at that time it was. But everybody was so glad uh, to to get out of Europe and come to America that this didn't matter to them. just overwhelmed because the buildings seemed to be converging. I had never seen such tall buildings and maybe they were four or five stories but to me they were huge and it looked to me that they were going to meet somewhere up there. It's the best country in the world, with all its faults, and there are faults. Nothing's perfect. I'd rather be here than anywhere else. <laughs>